This thing's really coming along, huh? Yeah? I was actually just about to come talk to you. I don't know what the hell to do to mine. Well, let's, let's come up with a game plan. I guess so. Yours is like almost done, dude. What really? the hell? I mean, I'm, I'm on a roll here. How much were those tires? Expensive? They're like 100 bucks. Oh, that's not that bad. For all? No. For, oh. For the oh. packs and then like 30 bucks. Where do you get those? Tractor supply? Uh, yeah, tractor supply or get them from ATV. Ray, really? They yeah. sell tractor tires? Yes. I had no idea. Yeah. So what are the mods you got? You got the welded div, how's that? The welded div, which I haven't, I haven't tested yet. I mean, I know it's working. Yeah. You can't fucking push the thing around it. Yeah. <laughs> um, I did the tires, shovel seat, got rid of the deck. I repurposed the PTO engagement or the blade engagement and it turned it into a brake. Really? Yeah. So that stops you? Yeah, so this is my brake, see? How good does it stop, like if you're going 40? I, I don't know, I don't go 40, I like, go like five. <laughs> so so I, that was top yeah, speed, yeah. <laughs> you know? Yeah. So, I mean, realistically, I never used the brake except for like I'm getting on and off the truck, you know? Mm. So, that's probably all. Damn, man, I can't even lie, this thing looks pretty sick. It's not bad, right? Kind of jealous, mine looks like a pile of crap. I've got something else coming too. Oh my God, what's that? Toe hitch. A toe hitch. Right now, I just put a ball in there. Yeah. But there's like a nice like three point rig brings this to like here you're an animal you know that dude we're gonna do it for, for real <laughs> we're gonna next is yours we're gonna go through yours take stuff apart yeah i did a little wire tuck on mine oh too. my this got guy what are you talking about a wire tuck I mean, not tug, but i got rid of all the extra wires <laughs> you know? so that's it there's no, no more safeties this thing is clean i gotta pressure wash mine today so you can start this one yeah let's clean it up you can start it oh that's nice that's nice I like that a lot actually. Yeah, that makes a big difference when you're working on it and doing stuff like that. No, for sure. Well guys, I guess um, we're gonna pull out the tractor today. Let's do it. Jeez. All right guys, so we got good old reliable out here, Jack, dude. First impressions right now. She's dirty. She is a dirty girl. The first She's thing dirty. I wanna do is I wanna, you think I should just take the engine out? I, I think that like a frame off, like take it off and, and go through everything. You could paint it, you could do some cool stuff. That'd be that'd definitely be an option. But before you go that far, I think the most important thing we should do is just verify that everything works. Yeah, and right now we just actually tried to start it in the starter is like what, not just unlocking? Yeah, I think the Bendix is messed up on the starter. Yeah, the so Bendix, like, there you go. It's not shooting the gear up to catch the flywheel or the whatever and, you want to call Yeah, it. and then it's not spinning this and then the engine's obviously not turning. Exactly. Therefore, it's not starting. Even though, I mean, yesterday I was having that problem. I kept having to go like this to like kind of like right. set it, but yeah. that doesn't even make sense because that it just the starters is doing whatever it feels like really it, it's what it seems like so that would be the first thing i would say let's take that off and get a working yeah track. it's a tractor now it's a, it is a tractor now yeah. it is not a mower so on. game plan number one i'm just gonna go ahead i'm gonna take this starter out i'm gonna be honest i was like yesterday's day i was walking around I'm like where's the damn starter i didn't even know that was the starter yep. i've never worked on a small engine this before is, really you never so good. this is a good motor too it's you got, keep saying that it is though because it's got that it's got that oil filter on it and stuff that's nice that's so you think sign. it's better yeah i think that's a, that's a good that's a sign of a good engine it's a good platform to start with it's decent i wouldn't call it we got to get rid of this yeah, do we, we need all this no we're gonna get rid of that and, and we're going straight out yeah dude honestly we can flat. probably cut it right here flip and just it. flip it well i don't think so because this the point, flange is different yeah that would put your exhaust like going this all way. right fine we cut it right there and then weld sign i want to yeah. start welding anyway so that's pretty cool that's a good way to start tractor we'll flip use, we'll use that flange yep we'll go to tractor supply They've got all the supplies. <laughs> yeah, that's and then we'll a get, good one. Yeah, we'll get we'll get a pipe that comes up like this, and then it's got a muffler like this, or you can straight pipe it. I might straight pipe and it. And just put a flapper on it. I love know, it. So, like... so we have. I have an issue with this. I think I'm actually gonna end up getting another one. Yeah. Like I'm. We're gonna do this one for the pull off with yours. Yeah. But this is a um, hydrostatic drive, so you right. can't make this one fast, exactly. correct? Exactly. That's the problem. The hydrostatic drives are good for, for, for pulling because you, you got a good good uh, low gear, you know? But, yeah. But you can't go fast because you can't just do a pulley swap. Okay. The idea is, you know, with a, with a belt-driven training, you've got individual gears. Yeah. And, and that yeah, and this you, isn't. This isn't, yeah. This is basically like one hydrostatic <laughs> gear. Yeah. Yeah. 
<laughs> so I think where this one's gonna be for towing and doing drop and change with this guy over here, not yet, because obviously this dude's been souping up without me, but let me know if that's something you guys are into. I am, I really wanna do it, because one, I think it would be cool to try to make like a drift tractor. Definitely. What are the odds we can put PVC on the back Pulley swap it and like try to do brakes and it'll drift. It will. Absolutely. It will. On, on a on a gear drive one, yeah. Yeah. Absolutely, because you're able to pulley swap. Those guys are going like 40 miles an hour with those. So imagine you got 40 mile an hour wheel speed. Yeah. You can drift like crazy. But you can lower these too, or is that kind of annoying? That's kind of annoying. Yeah. I think it's worth it if you if you want to go really fast. Yeah. But. I think it's safer. It is definitely safer. And I think it, we should widen the track stance, you know? Yeah. yeah. Put it, put like five inch spacers. Exactly. We'll be good to go. Good to go. So we definitely have some plans. Let us know down in the comments if that's something you're into. I'm sure if I'm getting another tractor, I think Jack would as well probably. <laughs> I mean, what's wrong with that? Dude, the, well, we're going to have really that's slow funny. ones and really and, fast okay, ones, so, you know? Yeah. Dude, imagine me and you at a drift track drifting. <laughs> I It'll found, probably never happen. I found funny. one on Facebook. Yeah. I'm gonna show it to you. I'm oh god. Oh man. Don't don't make me buy another tractor, Jack. Wild. Jesus Christ. Well, I'm gonna take the starter off. Jack's gonna look at that, and after that, I'm gonna dive deeper, try to clean everything, and just make this thing more presentable. I think we're gonna paint it today as well. So we've got a lot to do today. All right, boys. Well, we found the corporate. That's not how you say, it, huh? It's, it's definitely not corporate. <laughs> Culprit. Culprit. Culprit? Look at that sucker, dude. Can you fix that? It's pretty bad. Let's see. <laughs> yeah, we need a new starter, dude. I don't know. This, I think the top just popped off. It might be able to go back on. It needs a nut, though, no? It's all oh, it's jammed. jammed. Ooh, yeah. she's real bad. Should we just try to start her up yeah, and see no, if it'll fly off? No. <laughs> no. That's why that noise was. That, Woo! Is this a plastic gear? Yeah, that's what that's it looks interesting. Like. So they, that's. They call it phenolic. I think that's broken, no? Yeah. I think that's think pretty so. fair to say. <laughs> oh, boy. Watch your eyes. <laughs> Not bad. It's pretty gnar. Are we taking a tractor's play trip? I mean, I don't know if they sell these at tractors. What? You said they had everything, Jack. You know, I mean, starters? <laughs> talking like pulleys and things, for sure. This, Not starters. Uh, I don't know. Let's take the starter off and see if I can get this back together. All right, guys. So we put the starter back in. We need like a snap ring or something to actually hold this from shooting out. We don't have anything like that. So we kind of just put two zip ties on it to see if it will stop. We're gonna fix it later, but really I just wanna make sure this works so then I can actually take the engine out, completely strip this thing and clean it, paint it, and then we can worry about that after. But I just wanna see if it'll work for now. So let's connect the jumper cables. Is this battery's dead like everything else in my life? And we're ready to pop her. Is this even plugged in? What the fuck? Blew the circuit. Cool, all right, here we go. I think that, did that just shred right off? Oh, it's not lifting up now. So why is it doing that? I think the Bendix is no good. The zip tie's working. Yeah, for now. <laughs> it's not engaging. All right, don't don't touch anything. Okay, Let's see if I can get it to come up into the... Can you even lift it up? That's what I'm trying to do. It's like not really... I think that's the problem. It's not going past a certain point. Yeah, it's like getting stuck. Yeah. So we need a new starter. Looks like it. That's sick. That's annoying. Day number one, already breaking ship. Try it again. <laughs> eh, it broke. It broke? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ripped to the zip tie. Yeah. All right, well, we definitely need like some sort of snap ring or something. Or should we just get a new starter? Like why are we even messing with this? Exactly. Like this is just stupid. Yeah. I yeah. see a new mower in your future. Well, I'm gonna take this thing apart. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get a starter and we're gonna take this apart. <laughs> so we need a new starter, but before we do that, it's just time to strip this thing apart. Like there's just a bunch of stupid stuff like this, this bracket, that bracket that's dragging on the ground that I'm just gonna completely take off. We're gonna take the engine out so we can actually clean. I don't know if you call this an engine bay, I'm gonna call it an engine bay. So we can clean out the engine bay. What the fuck is this? Is this your fucking oil drain? Is that how you drain your oil right there? I've never done an oil change in one of these. What is this spigot, dude? It's your oil drain. That's, it's a spigot. <laughs> That's been obviously uh, modified. Jesus Christ, so. First m motor pole on a tractor. Go for it. Four bolts and a belt. How hard could it be? Let's see. Look at me, Jack. You're, you're a dirt Jack, ball. Jack, what have you done to me, man? You're a dirt ball. You I'm look, a fucking dirt ball. You look like a Florida redneck now. Right. What do I do? Just pick this thing up? Am I yeah, gonna hurt myself? Think, no, it's probably weighs about 50 pounds. If that. I got this. this. Yeah, I'll just move that. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. 
not now, exhausting. For the record, off. I offered to lift this up myself, but Chris said he wanted to do it. We're just gonna pop that exhaust off real quick. We got gas going there. Oh God. <laughs> All right. Welcome to the Haggard Redneck Pole, baby. <laughs> I'm gonna start dipping. Take two boys, my first tractor pull. All right. Actually, my second tractor pull, right? I mean, technically, yeah. Oh, the pulley. You gotta go, the pulley's gotta go through the, off the belt. What happened to the nice, easy engine pull, Jack? It's gonna happen. <laughs> Maybe we should take the pulley off. Yeah, should I pop that off? Yeah. All right, take 15. <laughs> what is that, a 17? 15? Oh, yeah. 716, That's garbage. Some kind of American thing. <laughs> All right. take, take three. This one's gonna work. <laughs> I hope so. Got it. There it is. We got the engine out. Is it okay to rest it on this keyway? Yeah, it's not. Yeah, you mean the crankshaft or yeah. whatever? Yeah, that's fine. Yo! Look at that. First tractor pull, boys. We did it. This is not the pull we were waiting for, but. Well, that pull is coming very soon. I'm gonna cut this off. Cut this what off? Uh, belt guard. Oh really? Yeah, get that thing out I of thought way. that's like what makes it not come off. Well, it's just annoying because it's very annoying because yeah. you can't get the belt exactly. off. Exactly. How do you do a belt swap without ripping uh, it out? I just gotta pull the motor out. Yeah. <laughs> At least pull the pulley off. So this is cool. Now I can pressure wash this thing. I want to delete that seat safety. How do I do that? Oh, that's simple. Right here two wires okay just get a splice thing and just put these together that's it that's it come on that's it and will you you won't need to sit on this anymore you won't need to sit on it It'll how do you not make it so the clutch you don't have to keep the clutch in so there's another switch down here that's connected to this well, it's so it's wires yeah okay same thing. Just so just find that and put them together and that's it that's it those are the two modifications I want to do. Right here and start it up. God, I love that. That's old school. It's fucking JDM, dude. That's a JDM way. Because you don't need a clutch. Oh, yeah, it's right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I need to go run an errand real quick. So I'm going to leave this here. Thank God Alex is here. And um, when I get back, we're going to pressure wash this thing, clean it. And just, I, I'm working all night. I'm sorry I'm not posting tonight. Actually, blame this guy. Blame this guy right here. Because I don't want to feel rushed. I need to catch up to jack listen they like the tractors i hope they do like the tractors because i'm gonna stay here all night and bust this thing out we're tell getting this him, thing painted tell them in the comments how much please you like tell me the in the comments because i'm literally breaking my balls out here working on this stupid thing this but it's fun. fun it's fun for sure i think this is what's the problem like why it's so loose yeah what are these things over here. That's a steering link i think it's up here oh really can we get adapters dude i want to put a nardi on mine yeah how flex would that be <laughs> I'm gonna go run my errands and I'll be right back. All right guys, so I told you we're going all out on this tractor, right? So we got some spray paint. This isn't the color I want. I'm gonna post a picture of what I want right now. I think I only have one. If I can find more cans at the shop, I'm gonna be using that, but I'm just gonna get three of these just in case. We got black because we're gonna do kind of a two-tone look. The yellow is um, just for something that I'm gonna mess around with. And then we got more black and some clear coat. We also got some Simply Green so we can strip out the whole thing. We got these. I hope this is enough. I'm just gonna scuff it up. It doesn't have to be perfect. It's a fucking junk tractor, so. All right, guys, so we're back at the shop now. It's time to pressure wash this bag, girl. You can see this thing is absolutely filthy. So we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna pressure wash it, and hopefully we can get this thing spotless. Really stripping this thing out right now. We took this fake little horn thing off real quick. This would have helped, right? Maybe this is why half the steering wheel goes like this without turning the fucking steering. So we're gonna take the steering wheel off, take all this off, take this off, cause we're gonna paint this. We're gonna paint the whole thing and just try to restore this thing, I guess you can say. I'm not gonna lie, man, fuck me. I started pressure washing. Things, it, it was looking pretty clean. And like, as I dove deeper, I saw some like grass mountains, some dirt mountains. And I'm like, all right, we'll, go, we'll dive a little deeper, go a little deeper, go a little deeper. And now we're here. We got a piece of sheet metal on wheels. So, <laughs> why did I do oh. <laughs> Matt comes here and he's like, what the fuck are you doing? I'm like, dude, I don't know. I saw, I saw Jack's tractor today. I was like, yo, this dude can't be showing me up like that. So, I'm going to try to make this thing as nice as I can. And I just decided to take the whole thing apart, I guess, to paint it. Pa uh, I was being serious, paint it green and give it away. So uh, we're painting it green and- Are we giving it away? 
We're, no, we're no one wants this. We're not giving it away. Oh, you don't want that? You don't, yo. You, oh, dude. You grabbed you, it. Oh. You, 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 dude. <laughs> I had to, That's dude. In Florida. Yo, dude. Give away some Florida. Yo, dude, how am I to take a fucking chew of this? Two grand. Two grand? Two grand if you, dirt in my You're mouth. a fucking half dude, I would do this for a hundred dollars. Do that would do it. You're gonna give me a hundred bucks? Give me twenty. What? I said a hundred dollars, sir. I mean it's just dirt. You spit it out and you fucking rinse it out. Anyways, um yeah, I'm kinda happy I did that because I'm gonna try to get this thing as clean as possible now that we're bare shell. Thanks, Jack. Thanks for this, man. <laughs> Been slaving away to this tractor all day. We can call it a tractor now because it doesn't have the bottom. But uh, yeah, anything. I'm gonna do a sticker delete. We got a bunch of stickers here, like this automatic lawn tractor. We're gonna get rid of that. We're gonna get rid of all these warnings because we don't need any warnings here. We already know this thing's gonna be dangerous and stupid. I'm gonna start doing that and hopefully by sometime tonight I can start painting. All right, boys, well, a lot is going on right now. I already started painting. I'm gonna be honest, I don't love this color. It's not minty green enough, so we're not doing that. We're just gonna do that one panel, that color. We're gonna, like I said, we're gonna do a two-tone between black and blue, but we're gonna be using this. I don't know where the can is, so I'm just gonna pull up the picture right now. My friend's going to Walmart. He's gonna get some for me. We're sanding, we're doing a bunch of stuff. We got Matt here, he's sanding as well. He already sanded the engine bay, but if you guys remember in yesterday's video or two days ago, me and Nat actually picked up this tractor. <laughs> he's about to be here, he's just getting out of work right now. He has no idea this thing's a part, so it's gonna be pretty funny getting his reaction, so. Is that him? Oh, that would've been funny if that was him right there, but I'll start recording when he gets here. Nat just got here. Yeah, dude, I'm really balls deep in this. Look at this thing. Do you remember? <laughs> Do you remember what it looked like yesterday? Does that thing run? No, look at the engine. It's on the ground. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think, dude? Uh, what do I think? I'm painting, I'm painting it green and giving it away. <laughs> look at it. It's a piece. <laughs> <laughs> this thing's gonna this do Mac something. Daddy. This it's Mac the Mac Daddy. Daddy. It's gonna, I'm gonna try to tow the Mac Daddy, actually. That's yeah, the challenge. Right. That's the challenge. That would be hilarious, actually. Tow my two-car trailer? That's a challenge and a half. All right, guys. So, Christopher Rudnick right here thinks he can tow the Mac Daddy. I didn't say I think I can. I just said I'm thinking I'm going to try it. You're going to blow the engine up trying. He's got 17 and a half horses. What are you talking about? Shit, you got to need a little bit more than that. But guys, look. This kid has everything everywhere. Oh, it's a, it's oh a, it's a, my it's God, disaster, dude. dude. I've been working on this for like eight hours now. He texted me late night. I was like, uh, what does late night claws. mean? We're ready to go, man. <laughs> We're ready Shit. to party. I mean, we just been sanding, painting, doing all the good stuff. You ready to put this thing together tonight? Guys, the next clip is putting the tractor together, and it's going to be together by the end of tonight. <laughs> 1045? <laughs> We're fucked. <laughs> All right guys, so I'm kind of at a standstill right now because I, had, I sent my friend to Walmart and they won't open the spray paint case because they're closing and that department's closed. So while that paint's drying and I'm getting ready for a clear coat, this engine is super, super sludgy. So I'm gonna go ahead, we're gonna take this off because I'm thinking I'm gonna paint this midnight purple because you know, like the teal and the purple, it'll kind of flow. This is gonna look so girly and stupid but I'm gonna love it. So we're gonna time-lapse, I guess, cleaning this engine. Enjoy. All right, ladies and gents. Well, the engine is looking pretty clean. Not perfect, but good enough for what we're trying to do. At the end of the day, this is still a tractor. I gotta remind myself, I'm really going extra here. We completely stripped down the tractor and I just wax and grease removed this whole thing. This thing is 
ready for some paint. And we're gonna just use this bed liner, this Herculine liner. I don't know what the fuck this is, but I'm just gonna spray it. We're gonna hope for the best. I'm gonna put bolts in the threads because I feel like this stuff, Jesus, I feel like this stuff is gonna be really thick. And if it gets in the threads, then it's gonna be kind of a nightmare to put bolts in. So wish me luck. We'll see if this thing comes out all right. So obviously, I, don't, I probably don't have to say this, but I'm gonna say it anyways. This is how you not paint. Kenny Franklin with my hurt counter. Yo, what happened, happened to you? Uh, severed my fingertip. Did you film it? No, I didn't film it. No, <laughs> did you like film the whole vlog thing of you messing your finger up? Oh yeah, I filmed at the hospital and everything. Like yeah, that, yeah, so. definitely check out his channel for that. That thing is gnarly. You got like pictures you can like throw up on yours? Yeah. You I got mean, like I down to the I bone? Don't, I don't know, I don't know if it's like able to go though. Oh, uh, you might get demonetized. Yeah, it's get, pretty gory, yeah, dude. It's pretty gory. That that was like up there with Marcus's face. True. Yeah. I mean, you guys you, are kind of tied for that. I know. I mean, <laughs> did your video get demonetized? For no, me? it didn't. Okay. So you're probably good. I put it in the I, thumbnail, dude. Okay. Yeah, you did. I forgot about that. <laughs> but we're gonna paint this bed liner. Fuck it. Send it. I know it's not a good job, but like for what this thing is, it's gonna be pretty sick. <laughs> you know? <laughs> I think so. Right. Fuck it. We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out some Oh yo, spray this too. Oh shit, good eye, man. That's not clean. <laughs> you didn't see it, so who else is? Yo, bed liner sticks to everything. Oh, we got more, dude? No. Oh, we did sand these. Look at this part. Ooh, yeah, let's get that. Look at this. Oh, no. Yo, we're getting on the ground for this one. Dude, it looks pretty good. Not bad. I mean, so, even it is completely wet right now. How many coats are we doing? Until this can runs out. So we're just going to wait another 15 minutes. Do one more coat. Are you sure that's how long we're supposed to wait? No, I'm just guessing. But it should be good. It's a tractor. Cut. Cut. <laughs> so we're going full rice with this one, right? We got Mads junk stink stickers made thanks to John over here. He just printed these at literally 2 a.m. He's a trooper. And he also printed these. We've been like working on merch designs and stuff. And like this is kind of like, how do I explain? It's a quick mock-up. This is like a quick mock-up. This is nothing that we're using right now, but quick mock-up is going to work great for the tractor. It's going to look so good. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to throw these on right now, see what it looks like, and I'll then I'll show you. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Well, there it is. I'm like starting the question. I'm like, damn, man, why the fuck did I pick teal? But well, mint green and gave it away. I did it only for the memes. So fuck it. We also did some purple. You want to do the teacup or the Dixie cup? What is it? Oh yeah, the jazz cup. The jazz cup. Okay, I'll get a picture. So we got Matt. We can just throw it up right now. This is what we're going to be doing to the hood. He's sanding it right now. I guess the game plan is we're going to paint it white and then a purple and blue stripe. Just because why not? It's a tractor. Who cares? It's, it looks cool. Great. If not, at least it looks better than it did. That's all we're going for right now. So it's going. We're just waiting for the bed liner to dry and we can actually start to put this back together. I'll be honest, this is probably my favorite. I think this is a little crooked, but I guess it makes sense, right? This is the cluster. This is where the um, steering wheel goes and your mower thing and your throttle. Good to go. Junk. I had to pull my can or my phone out because these animals just decided to pick. Oh, oh, the brake. Pick it back up. Pick it back up. All right. Well, 
Here is the tractor. So I'm really sorry that we didn't finish it tonight. To be honest, I've been working the past 11, we, we've been working the past 11 hours on this thing, dude, slaving away, sanding, wax and grease remover, prepping everything, painting, taking the thing apart. Like this thing was a sludge monster. Yeah, look at that. That's all bed liner, dude. We're kind of killing it. To be honest, I'm a little upset that we spent so much work and I decided to go teal, but at the same time, we're gonna save it because we're gonna do the jazz cup on the hood. What do you think that's gonna look like? It's gonna be one funky <laughs> tractor. If you didn't paint it already, and, oh, well, if I wasn't in the hospital for five hours, I would've told you to do the general recolor. Oh, that would've been cool too, honestly. But I'm building this because I saw Jax and like he want, he's pretty serious about this like toe off, so I'm like, screw it. It's, it's a good time, it's fun, we all had fun doing it. It's whatever, man. I'm a little sad that I kind of forgot about this. I really gotta figure out this intercooler piping and stuff so we can get this back on the road. But I'm gonna hit up Harvey tomorrow and see if we can come up with a better game plan, either if we're gonna route it differently or if he has to cut the intercooler pipe somewhere else. I don't really know yet. I haven't even mocked it up. Today was literally the tractor. But I will have you know, we put this power steering pump in and everything and it was a little... It's a little weird. Sat for two days, right? Started up today, moving around. Power steering works great. There's no cutouts. There's no nothing. Maybe she just was a little tired that day and she decided to just not work. But tractor. It's not a tractor yet. It will be a tractor tomorrow, I promise you. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys liked this video, give it a thumbs up. If you guys want to subscribe for more, subscribe for more. I'm absolutely exhausted right now. It's 3.05 in the morning and I have to get up at 10 for PT, so... It just, we had, we had to call it. Um, I still got a shower. I'm disgusting. And uh, yeah, peace out, guys. Guess who's back? Back again. Matt is back. Tell your friends. Yeah, I'm doing these now, so get used to it. The video. <laughs> Give it a thumbs up, guys. Give it a thumbs up. <laughs> Yo, you trying to shoot someone, dude? <laughs>